Article 26. Uh, shall the Town of Hampton vote to raise and appropriate the sum of $115,350 for the purpose of purchasing the following items of equipment for the Recreation and Parks Department? A one-ton dump truck for the Recreation Department to replace its current 1999 one-ton dump truck, which shall be traded in as part of the purchase if deemed to be prudent by the Recreation and Parks Department Director, Town Manager, and Board of Selectmen. New playground equipment to replace obsolete play playground equipment at Five Corners Park, all as determined by the Board of Selectmen, the Town Manager, and the Director of Recreation and Parks Department. And, to, and three, to authorize the withdrawal of $115,350 from the Recreation Infrastructure Special Revenue Fund established for the purpose under Article 44 of the 2007 Annual Town Meeting. Majority vote required. Recommended by the Board of Selectmen 5-0. Recommended by the Budget Committee 10-2. to two. Fiscal impact, no. Finance Department, no. Tax impact. Is there a motion to open discussion on Article 26? Moved by Mr. Waddell. Is there a second? Seconded by Mr. Bridal. Is there, uh, Ms. Martin, would you like to speak to Article 26? Hello, I'm Diana Martin. I'm the Director of Recreation and Parks for the Town of Hampton. And Article 26 is asking the voters to allow the Recreation and Parks Department, with permission from the Board of Selectmen and Town Manager, to withdraw up to 115 350 in funds from the Recreation Infrastructure Fund for the purpose of purchasing two things. To replace a very old one-ton dump truck. This truck is an essential piece of equipment for the Parks Department to keep the parks and play areas clean, safe, and playable. This equipment replacement is overdue as it is like the DPW trucks, corroding and old. It is also a piece of equipment that is used daily nine to ten months out of the year. This article also will allow us to replace the playground equipment at Five Corners Park. Playgrounds have an average lifespan of about 14 years. This playground equipment has been standing in their spot when I started my job here in 1993. It is time for this generation of children to get a current playground that it, in that neighborhood. And the good news is because this, um, the monies that replace this equipment come from the Recreation Infrastructure Fund, there is no tax impact, so I'm encouraging voters to vote in the affirmative of this article. Thank you, Ms. Martin. Anyone else wishing to be heard, Mr. Waddell? Yeah, I'd just like to, you know, support this uh, article, and there's no tax impact, and plus the fact that if in the summertime or the fall, of the, the uh, summer or the, uh, the uh, spring, you go by any of our playgrounds, any of our parks, they're constantly used, there's constantly people playing on them, and I think the rec de uh, department does a great job keeping them up, and I support this. Thank you. Yes, sir. Uh, yes, sir. Tim Hamlin, uh, Morningside Drive. Um, I'm on the rec department advisory council. Um, I'm also uh, an employee of the town of Hampton through the police department. Um, I have two young children, four and seven. We're constantly at these parks. The one at Five Corners, that playground equipment hasn't changed since I moved here 20 years ago. Uh, I've taken my kids there once, and unfortunately there's no reason to go back. I'm in walking distance of all those parks. It'd be nice to have some new equipment that's actually usable at that park for the families that are in that area that can walk to that park. It's a great location. Uh, it would be nice for families to be able to use the equipment um, in the space that is provided. Uh, as far as the dump truck money goes, those parks that, uh, again, were there a lot, the employees of the rec department worked very hard to make all of the equipment and the play areas usable, clean, friendly, and fun to be at, and they do an excellent job. Uh, a truck that's, uh, you know, a 1999 uh, pickup is uh, not usable, um, they need something new so they can continue to provide the um, play areas and the equipment uh, and the cleanliness that we expect as residents and certainly I expect as a parent bringing my kid there. So please um, support this article. Thank you. Thank you very much. Anyone else wishing to be heard on Article 26? Mr. Griffin. I'd just like to say that, again, this is another case of uh, in past boards that I've been on, we have not uh, improve things like this uh, playground equipment and like it's been stated here this is not going to raise the taxes and this is very important in trying to make sure that we have things like this for the kids of Hampton and th a lot of people use the the parks that we have thank you thank you mr. Griffin uh, seeing no further um, interest in discussing article 26 uh, 